गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स मैं सर डॉक्टर एम एच चन्नैया आई एक्सटेंड ए हॉटी वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी द सेक्शन ऑफ ए स्क्वेर पिरामिड विच हैज गॉट ए बेस मेजर इन थर्टी एम एम एंड हाइट इज इक्वल टू सिक्सटी एम एम फ्रॉम दी वर्ड टेक्स टू द सेंटर ऑफ द बेस इज कॉल दाइट इट इज रेस्टिंग ऑन एच पी ऑन इट्स बेस सच दैट One of the base edges or two adjacent base edges are equally inclined to VP, and we obtain the top and front views of the solid. The top view is going to be a square of side thirty mm, and front view is going to have two triangles. This is one triangle, that is the other triangle, and you will be able to see one, two, three slant edges of the solid. So I have written the top view. Which is a square with O joined to all the corners like A, B, C, and D, and we obtain the front view of height sixty by projecting all these lines. This is the front view. This is the top view. Here in the top view, O A, O B, O C, and O D represent four slant edges of the base. Here, these are the vertical edges. All the slant is O dash A dash, O dash C dash, O dash B dash, and O dash D dash. This all the four point O dash O one dash is the axis that is perpendicular to H P. And friends, this is being cut by a section plane perpendicular to both H P and V P. Friends, you have this pyramid like this, and this is being cut by a section plane perpendicular to both H P and V P. In other words, the section plane which is cutting this solid perpendicular to both H P and V P will be seen as a line in the top view and also as a line in the front view. And where is that passing through? He says such that the true shape you are going to get is going to be a triangle with thirty mm side. So friends, here what I do when it is perpendicular to both H P and V P. Very obviously, friends, the section plane is seen as a line in the top view and as a line in the front view. Say this is section plane, yes and yes, that is cutting the solid such that this distance, whatever you get here, is going to be the base of that, which is equal to thirty mm. So I have marked this, and these are the two points where. The base of the solid is cut. So we have two points here, one on the what is called the slant edge of the solid, and very obviously, after removing this small part, when you view the solid in this direction, you will be able to see the true shape in the end view. So what I do, I have this point. Say these are point number one, point number two. One is on AD, so I just take a horizontal line through that, and a vertical line here. So this point is going to be one. Similarly, equal distance on the other end, you will have two, and height O dash D dash is cut here. What is that point? So this is D double dash in the end view. A double dash, C double dash is this point in the end view. This is B double dash. Friends. You can just write a horizontal line through that, so as to cut the slant edge O A here. That is to say, this point, this point, is this point that is obtained here. That is on to say O A, O A here. So then, you got three points. Join all these three points by a straight line. So I am going to join three to one. Three to two, and this one to two, and then hatch that or section that by drawing lines at forty-five degrees to the horizontal. And friends, this is the true shape which you obtain in the end view. I will show this triangle as true shape. That is a triangle, and we have been asked to find what is the measure the height of triangle. The height of triangle is this measurement. And this can be measured using a scale, that is height. And friends, 
The portion we have retained here is this part. For drawing this section, so I will show this by visible line. And this also existing here. And in the end view, very obviously you have this OD, OB and OC. So I am going to show this by full line. The lost plant edge by full line. And this part is also available. This is 1 and 1 comma 2. This point is 3. I have marked there. And you have to join this line also. Friend, the whole figure will give you LACV or left sectional end view or sectional side view. The left sectional end view is obtained on the right profile plane. The whole figure is called left sectional end view. This is the front view of the solid. This is the top view of the solid. In the top view, you have to darken these slant edges like this. This port is retained and this part is removed. This is removed. From the section plane to the left is removed. And this is how friends we obtain the section of a square pyramid through the given dimension. Friends, please go through the complete video. If you like this video, do share this video with all your friends without fail. Have a blessed day. Thank you for watching my YouTube videos.